If you're looking to buy cheap and custom controllers, be sure to check out singegaming.com and use discount code CSHD for 5% off. What's going on guys, Casual Savage here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to make a speaker out of these items on the screen. So, bulldog clips. I brought small ones, but when you buy them, make sure you buy bigger ones than these because they're not the best. And you'll need a phone or an iPod, any phone, it doesn't have to be an iPhone, uh, any type of knife, pen knife for example. Don't know the full name of this one. Some spray paint, this is a car spray paint, but it'll still do the job and it's white. You can choose any colour you want. And finally, you'll need a Pringle box, so you get to eat stuff to make this video as well. So, the first thing you actually want to do is spray paint all of this. I've made the mistake, I've actually made this hole first, I'll tell you more about that in a minute, but really you're supposed to spray it first and it will make much more sense later on. So spray it and then let's get to the next step. So then once it is sprayed you want to get the knife or pen knife whatever you're using and you want to cut a hole like this. Now notice the iPhone won't fall through it you can see, boom, it just slides in like that, top view maybe, you can see the iPhone doesn't actually take all the space up, so now the way I've done this, I put the iPhone still like this, and then I just drew a line there, and a line there, end to end, and then I cut that out. So once you have cut it out, make sure this does slide in like this. So, my spray can actually takes 30 minutes to dry, so make sure you read the instructions on your spray can before spraying. So after the 30 minutes, I went back and put a second coating on just to make the paint show more. So, as you can see it is done. I put two coatings on this, meaning I painted it one time, waited it for to dry, then I painted it again with a second layer, and as you can see, the spray can is empty. So you may need to buy two, depending how much spray or how good the spray actually is. Because you know I've made a mistake, you're going to probably buy the big bulldog clips. So once you have turned them inside out, you only need one by the way if you're using a big bulldog clip. What we want to do is put it like this and then like that. So you can see it is firmly stuck to it like that. Which means when it is on the floor it will be able to stand up. So that is why you need the big bulldog clips. Because it will allow it to stand up much easier. And the way I'm doing it. Let's just say you buy the small ones because you think it looks better. I'm going to put three of them like this. It's a bit harder. I'm going to put three of them like that on each side. And then you'll see they do stand pretty good. And I'm going to put tape across that. So that is your next step. So yeah, this is the final product as you can see. I've added it all on here. I'm just going to show you really quick how I've done this. So, the bulldog clips here, I've added them on, stuck them together here, then I've stuck it on at the bottom here as well, and then with the same side, I've done the exact same thing, and then I put a thicker layer of tape on the back, just to keep it good support. So, I would actually recommend painting it after you've done all this part, because then you get rid of all the tape and the bulldog clip colour. So, yeah, maybe you should have painted it black, but oh well, it still looks good to me. If I still have more paint, I would have done it. So now, we're going to test out with my iPhone 4. We're going to be using my outro song, and yeah, make sure you stay, because even though I use my outro song, it's not actually going to end yet. So, this is going to be played directly into my mic, which is like, uh, it's right here. Oops, okay. So I'm going to play it first without it being in the speaker, so from here, and then we'll go in.
now I'm actually going to show you something else. I've got a mini speaker here and volume is on. So, because it's a mini speaker, let's put it right in here. So it's a bit difficult because you have to try and grab the wire. There we go, it actually came straight out, so here's the wire. Boom. Now the speaker's actually upside down as you can see. It's upside down there. So we're going to play it upside down and we'll still get a good sound. Okay, so as the speaker is at the top, this will actually have to go upside down. You can see speaker is here and yeah, it's nothing there. So we're going to put it upside down, but that does not matter because it will still fit in nice and easy. So there we go, it is now connected to the speaker which is inside. And if we play it, Now to me, that sounds much louder when the speaker is actually in here. You can see the speaker was in there the entire time, but it was upside down so it was facing down. If you can figure out a way how to make it face out, then obviously you'd get the best sound quality. So yeah, that is it. I'm just going to show you really quickly. I've got an Android phone, the speaker is on the back, so obviously it'll work for that. And you can see, it fits nicely into that. It looks a bit tilted. but. Yeah, it does fit nicely and it does work. So that is an Android phone. An iPod Touch 5th generation. Very thin as you all know. Boom. Fits in perfectly. And finally, the iPod Touch 4th generation. Boom. Even more perfect. Now remember I made this for my iPhone 4. And look at that. I'm just showing you different phones. Well, three different types, and all of them fit. So yeah, that right there is the speaker. And I'll just show you that this part here, the sound actually comes out. I'll show you right now. You notice when you cover speakers, you could usually hear a different sound effect. So I'm going to cover this hole right here. There you go. So that proves all, all airwave and sound is coming straight through there, directly out of here. And yeah, that is it. Be sure to try and make one yourself, it's pretty cheap. As I said, you get to make this, you get to eat the Pringles first, obviously. You get to um, just buy the Bulldog clips, I got them for one pound. I got the tape, I think you can get it for like a pound as well, that's two pound. Pringle box varies between one and two pound, I think. So that is four pound or three pound maybe if you get it for one pound. And spray paint, which I also got for a pound. People from UK, Poundland is the way to get this stuff from. Hopefully you followed all the steps and you were able to make one yourself. Be sure to leave a video response and I'll be happy to see which ones you can do. Make sure you customise it as well because I want to see how good you can do yours. So yes, being casual savage here, be sure to like my Facebook page and follow me on Twitter. Also be sure to check out my gaming channel where I upload daily. And finally be sure to add me on Snapchat where I just show you what I do throughout my day. So yes, being casual savage here, I hope you've liked this video. Please subscribe, rate and peace.